Okay, so as we continue looking at goalie histories, today's video is going to be kind of quick because really, honestly, San Jose has been pretty stable considering they came into the league in 1991. That's why I chose to do San Jose today because in the history of videos, I'm up to 1991, as every one of you knows. Right? Right. Uh, your your goalies for the expansion year are Jeff Hackett and Yarmo Millis. Hackett's a pretty solid goaltender, and Hackett's a guy that at some point I need to do a video of profiling because he went through a lot of losing situations. Uh, 92, 93, he's the backup for Archer Survey. So this also starts a new tradition in San Jose, which is European goalies. One that they've recently broken away from, but a lot of European goalies who played very well. 93, 94, Urbe plays 74 games. Nobody else plays 20. To get on the board, a goaltender has to have played 20 games that year. 94, 95, it's Urbe and Flaherty. Wade Flaherty. Kind of a, a a guy that everybody kind of pulled for because, you know, your most popular player is usually your, your backup goalie. 95-96, Terreri plays the starting minutes with Flaherty as the backup and Urbe as the third stringer. 96-97, Kelly Rudy joins the team and it's Rudy and Terreri. So a lot of turnover here. 97-98, it's Vernon and Rudy. It's Vernon and Shields in 98-99. And then in 99-2000, Steve Shields plays 67 games which gives the Bruins the idea that maybe he's going to be a starter and they end up taking him at some point soon. 2000-2001, Evgeny Nabokov comes in and Nabokov is your starter with Shields as the backup. Nabokov is starter in 01, 02, and 02, 03 with Mika Kiprasov as the backup. So you're, you're getting into an area here where San Jose becomes known for two things. One, European goaltenders, and two, churning out some pretty solid goaltenders as well. So a goaltending factory, there's one in Washington and there's one in San Jose as well. Um, and the Kings are good at, good at reclamation projects. Uh, 03 04, it's Nab Nabokov and Toskala. That's your tandem for 05 06 and 06 07. Of course, Vesta Toskala would move on to Toronto, where he would be uh, attacked a lot by Toronto fans for the way that Toronto played in front of him. It's one of those things. Uh, and when Toskala moves on, Nabokov plays 77 games in 2007 2008. 2008-2009, Nabokov's still your starter. There's Brian Boucher as the backup. Boucher bounced around a lot, too. At some point, I'll probably do one on him, too. 2009-2010, uh, of getting Nabokov with 71 games played. Nobody else plays 20. And then they move on from Nabokov in 2010-2011. He moves on from them. And it's a, it's a divorce that both player and team regret later. 2010-2011, Antti Niemi is your starter, and Antero Nidamaki is your backup. So... Euros. 2011-2012, Antti Niemi plays 68 games that year for the San Jose Sharks. So again, Niemi has had a reputation over the last few years as not being necessarily a great goalie, but he played a ton for San Jose, and that was coming off of a Stanley Cup win with, with the Shark or with the Blackhawks. So you can give and take however much credit for that Cup win that you want from him, but he had a number of good seasons in San Jose. Plays 43 games in 2012-2013. Remember, that is a lockout shortened season. So nobody else projected to play 20 that year. 2013-2014, it's Antti Niemi and Staylock is your backup. And that's your tandem for 14-15 as well. During the 2015 summer, uh, they decided they wanted to improve their goaltending. And via Boston, they get Martin Jones from the Kings. And Jones plays 65 games his first year and nobody else plays 20. 2016, 2017, and 2017, 2018. Jones is your starter, and Aaron Dell is the backup. And that is their tandem going into this season as well. So it'll it'll be potentially the third year of a tandem, which is not um, readily seen in, in their history. The only time it happens is Nabokov and Toskala. They had three years as a tandem. Urbe was here for three years. Felt like a lot longer. Nabokov, nine. Kiprasov, two. Toskala three, Niemi five, Jones is going into year four, and Dell going into year three. Uh, goaltenders, they've had 17 since 1991, and since 2000, they've gone through 10. Pretty solid, pretty stable goaltending overall. Um, they've gone through a number of backups, but when you look at their starters, Nabokov was uh, the guy in net for quite a while. Niemi had five years himself, and now Jones is going into year four. So they do commit to their starters, and I appreciate teams that do that. But there you go. Uh, San Jose's goaltending history doesn't require a ton of discussion. It's pretty solid. 
and uh, we'll see where they stand at the end of this whole series. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, as always. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you're browsing your way through. You just happened upon this video. And hey, this has been the goaltending history of the San Jose Sharks. I'll talk to you again soon.